So, five reasons why I think Vermintide 2 sucks. Number one, the classes. Why am I have to play for so long just to unlock all the different classes? Is it supposed to give me a feeling of progression? No, I should be able to use all the characters right from the start. I mean, why do they even include all these extra classes in the game if you can't use them from the beginning? I don't know what I'm going to like. Are you going to know what you're going to like until you've played far enough along? God only knows. So why even tease me with this until I actually get the chance to use it? I personally think it's bullshit. What do you think? So, the number two reason why Vermintide 2 sucks is the weapons. Not only are all the weapons in the game so vastly different that you can't really tell what they are because there's no description in it, you have to be able to unlock them before you get the chance to really use them. And since you can't use them right off the rip, you don't know what you should work for and what you should try. Not to mention, just the whole crafting system is so convoluted and difficult to understand and use. I want to be able to have access to my weapons right away, let me get in the game and start killing rats and chaos warriors. No, instead I gotta spend all this time collecting a bunch of different weapons that who knows if they're going to be better than what you currently have, and then you have to try to craft them through, again, a convoluted system. It's pointless and annoying, and I absolutely hate the entire thing. So, the number three reason why Vermintide is absolutely horrible is the random enemy spawns. You never know what you're going to get and when you go th going through the missions, so you can't plan accordingly. Like, some of the weapons are just going to naturally be better against certain enemy types, and other enemies are going to be weaker or stronger versus other things. And because of that, you have to spend all this time, and like, you can't pre-plan the way I normally would like to in most games. Instead, as you're going through the missions, enemies will spawn at random, you'll get different hordes, different enemy groupings, bosses will spawn at random intervals, God help you if a boss spawns at the same time as a horde does, then you're pretty much screwed. It makes the game unfun and borderline unplayable. I have no idea why they would include anything like this in their video game. The fourth thing that makes Vermintide 2 so horrible that it's nearly unplayable are grimoires and tomes. So, you can pick these up because at the end of the mission, they're going to give you better rewards and more experience but they negatively affect you so bad that it makes the game so much more difficult that it's almost impossible to beat the missions. Why would you want to make the game more difficult on yourself during a mission just to get slightly better rewards? It makes no sense. Were the programmers even in the right frame of mind? Were they thinking straight? Were they high when they designed this? To me, it is completely pointless and it takes me right out of the game, having to stop and run out of my way to pick up these tomes and grimoires, while meanwhile enemy hordes are spawning and coming after you, it's completely on fun. Why would anybody ever want to do this? I hate it so much. They should really remove it in a future patch, hopefully, so that way this game's at least a little bit more playable. The fifth and biggest issue with Fermentide 2 that I have and I'm sure everybody out there has, is the fact that you can't buy chess. In today's day and age, it's expected that your weapons and gear, whenever you open a chest, you should be able to buy it. Why do I have to spend hours on top of hours playing this game to get these chests to try to get better gear? I should be able to just go to an online store, pay some of my money, and get a shit ton of chests that I can then open up at my leisure and hopefully be able to upgrade my gear, become more powerful, and get to clearing the highest difficulty levels, and that's where the fun is. So I should be able to buy loot chests. Some microtransactions are what are needed in this game. If they don't have it, I don't see people playing this in a couple months. I don't see people playing this in a couple weeks. It's completely ignorant for the developers, the programmers, everybody involved to just be like, no, we don't want to have loot chests in our game. We want the players to work for it. Like, it's stupid. I, it's already built in the game. Let me just buy the chess. Anyways, guys, that's the five reasons why Vermintide 2 absolutely sucks. You should not buy this game. It's a complete waste of money, and it's 
thirty dollars. Thirty. I know most games nowadays are sixty dollars, and you might say, "Hey, it's got sixty dollars worth of content," but no, it's barely worth the thirty. Go somewhere else. This game is horrible. Anyways, guys, until next time, like, comment, subscribe. Good luck. Have fun. Peace.